Welcome to today's tutorial. In today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to run your Android Emulator on the latest Android Studio Electric EO or Ubuntu LTS 22.04.2. So many have um, noticed the fact that on some systems that you run Ubuntu it has some issues to run your Android emulator directly from your Android Studio when you click on the emulator to start so today I will show you how to get over such issues for, so first of all we will have to open up the Android Studio application and we wait for it to load this can take some time depending on your system and your system specifications especially the processors and processor and the RAM size so I project that I've created here so maybe I'll try to run it on the Android emulator but what we really need here is to see how to start up the emulator so to start an emulator on Android Studio, first of all, you would have made your, um, you would have prepared your emulators by downloading some of the tools you need in the Android uh, SDK, which are your Android SDK platform tools, your and then your system image. So, and when you want to start your emulator, you have to go to device manager and then click on this play button to launch this Android virtual device, which is AVD in the emulator. So, you click, then you say, you see, starting AVD. You can see the Android emulator it just has a black screen here and hangs without um, starting up. Try up everything you can. When you check on on your menu, you see that it is already here, but it cannot start up. So, what can you do? How can you then start up your Android emulator to run your applications on it? So that is exactly what we want to see in this tutorial. First of all, you can first quit the application. Then um, if you don't want to quit, you can actually go to you can go to your system monitor search for cure mu cure it equal system this that is the emulator. Now I click and say kill. Yes, kill the process. So now we'll head back to close this and then head back to Android Studio. It says the emulator process where the mobile has terminated. Yes. So then what can we do? For it to start 
then later you now head over to your terminal now head over to your terminal and when you check on the terminal your um, your directory is the location of where your project is so what you have to do is you have to change your directory to where the Android emulator is. So how can we achieve that? You say CD Android. This depends on your parts. Then you head to SDK then you head to emulator now we are in the emulator uh, parts or directory so for you to start the android emulator these are the commands you need you say dot forward slash emulator space dash avd then you name your AVD, in my case the name is mobile. In normal circumstances, the AVD, the Android virtual device, or the operator should start with this command. But in this um, circumstance, we have to add other commands for it to start. So we now say dash feature. dash modem simulator in a camera case then hit enter now we see that our android emulator has loaded up successfully you can wait for it to load it doesn't really take time on the device it depends on the still depends on the system specifications can keep it to be always on top uh, always we say we can keep it to be always on top and all that so this is how you start up your android emulator in ubuntu systems that systems that run on ubuntu can now start the android emulator by directly clicking on the play button in your device manager in your android studio i hope you've learned uh, one or two things today uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel and then like and comment in the uh, comment section thank you for watching